So Japanese Twitter is in a bit of a tussle with the Twitter cops at the current moment, you know, with, uh, you know, them trying to fondle their balls and hold them tight on a leash like they do in the Western world, where this lovable uh, art creator called BK, uh, BK Ub, uh, I don't know how to pronounce the Japanese part of his or her name, and it was a lovely art of a Splatoon character. But with art, there's always going to be complainers, and the complainers of this one is that they whitewashed a character. I'm going to show up some images now of some complete buffoons, uh, intolerable idiots getting upset over a character, which, you know, technically, yes, whitewashing is an issue, but threatening to kill someone over art is a bit, you know, how do I put this? of the loser agenda. And after BK Up got the backlash of these buffoons, uh, he catered to them, or her catered to them. I don't know. People, people. And for once, uh, apparently, which I usually don't see very often, is the Japanese community coming together and basically shitting on the people uh, that are claiming racism and whitewashing. First of all, these characters are made from a Japanese company with Japanese culture, which isn't- that's not white people, so you can't claim whiteness. And the Japanese people decided to discover and go into, per se, the Western ideology of a living shit ton of blackwashing of Japanese characters, such as the image here of Tanjiro, Deku from My Hero Academia, and two others I don't- I don't know the original anime from, but pretty much blackwashing. And obviously, Japanese people weren't exactly happy of the uh, Twitter police and Western ideology, as, uh, su uh, as such as, you know, uh, this user claimed. This is a negative influence of overseas political correctness, which wants to blackwash characters. I may seem hard of reading, it's because I am slow in the brain. Uh, on the other hand, if you change a black character to a white person, people will start complaining and it's racism. Which is true. Uh, people didn't seem to have an issue with uh, popular characters in Disney turning black, but say if uh, they turned, uh, you know, Princess and the Frog, the main character of that movie, white, there would be backlash and a shit ton of hate. Guys. Guys. Look. Look. They whitewashed Obama. Yeah, pretty much- it, this is pretty much making fun of the- the people that used, uh, you know, the color thing where you can just click on the color and you drag it over and it tells you the color, it, which apparently doesn't show anything of, you know, value, uh, because it just doesn't make any sense, so their opinion and point didn't exactly make any sense. Hey, like and subscribe to the video!